What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Let's talk some meme coins, right? Let's get into a Solana-based meme coin, right? Uh, Dog Whip Hat, we've talked about that a lot on the channel, as well as Pepe Coin and Dogecoin. We're gonna be kind of hammering a lot of those angles. Let's take a look into the market as well. Um, this is a very strong day uh, for all of the crypto market, but before we do, make sure you guys all smash that like button and please subscribe down below. Um, and let's get it, okay? So. Um, this is what we're looking at. Um, I do want to share with you guys what's going on in the rest of the market. You can see a very strong day into the green. Um, we talked a little bit about these meme coins, right? Pretty much every single day, uh, we have a reason to talk about them. We've seen Bonk down 1.8%, okay? Um, and I do want to pull up kind of why we're talking about this, but uh, Dog Whip Hat, 50th in market cap, uh, trading hands at $1.60. Um, it's only up 1.2% on the day, but let's get into some of the comments from this trader, okay? Uh, why we could see it plunge even further and the path forward for Pepe Coin and Dogecoin. So coming out from Credible Crypto, all right, telling uh, his subscribers that Dog with Hat has not yet formed a market bottom, uh, the actual quote, I do think that we would see some kind of dead cat bounce here, but I don't think that the downside is yet done, okay? So this is kind of, an illustration of where uh, viewing where we could see this uh, chart continue to form down in a bearish direction. Um, you could see it go as low as 80 cents with a couple price bounces along the way, but at $1.60 and up uh, about 3% in the last 24 hours, this is where we could see, you know, some more red territory for Dog Whip Hat, okay? Also, we want to talk a little bit about Pepe, okay? So Pepe have a 90 per, may have a 90% correction from its all-time high, uh, viewing that to drop even further. Um, there's a lot of support uh, where we're at trading in this green zone. You can see this right here. But ultimately, uh, thinking that Pepe coin is going to be heading lower. Um, so a lot of bearish sentiment coming out from Credible Crypto. Um, just wanted to share with you guys this insight. Um, you can do with it what you want. Um, obviously, it's not financial advice. It's just one crypto uh, kind of analyst opinion as we get further into 2024. Pepe is trading at that 50876 at the time of recording. Okay. And also uh, Dogecoin, thinking that Doge may retest the higher resistance levels if Bitcoin continues to rally. Okay. And I kind of agree with that, right? We talk Dogecoin every single day on the channel. Um, and this is where I've said it a lot. Uh, at 10 cents, this is a chance uh, to get into Dogecoin. It's a, it's a price where it's too cheap, in my opinion. Uh, and, and the actual quote coming down from Credible Crypto is that coins like Doge may see some relief to the upside. Uh, we've hit our first downside target area of demand, and we'll probably see a bounce along with Bitcoin and then find some resistance and continue to bleed as Bitcoin continues to pump. And then we get a little bit of a prolonged bleed to the downside. So a lot of bearish sentiment coming out from Credible Crypto. Um, and this is where you can see Doge possibly dipping down to that eight cents level and possibly retesting resistance at 15. Uh, and that's kind of where he's at within that kind of sentiment, okay? So my thoughts on Dogecoin, um, I talked to you guys a lot about it. A 13 to 16 cents is kind of the range it's comfortable at. Um, if we can get above 16 cents, that's obviously very bullish. That's a kind of a marker for me and where I'm happy with Dogecoin. Uh, it's something where if we're above 16 cents, I think we're in a good spot. But as these levels continue to illustrate some more bearish metrics. Is this just going to be a short-lived pump that we're getting? Um, who knows? Nobody has that crystal ball within crypto, but this is definitely a day where we need to celebrate the green uh, because uh, with all the, the bearish news that we had within the Mt. Gox liquidations, Bitcoin falling, um, this is definitely something where we need to kind of uh, celebrate these wins, okay? So Bitcoin, you know, up 1.1%. We're at 58.5 on the chart for BTC. Uh, so let's see if Bitcoin can conti continue this momentum and even more so, even get a high as 60,000 above again. Um, that would be very, very bullish. I think that we'd see a lot of crypto rally if we do have those conditions met. So I did want to share with you guys kind of these takes on a few meme coins that we talk about a lot on the channel. Uh, make sure you guys all subscribe, though, on your way out. Thank you for watching. Uh, appreciate you guys watching. And uh, smash that like button. And feel free, leave your price predictions down below in the comments as well. Um, and I'll be sure to uh, be in active in the comments uh, to respond to you guys. But thank you for watching. Uh, enjoy the rest of the weekend. We'll see you guys all in the next video. Cheers.